Hello everyone, it's John Tarek here. It's, uh, it's been a while actually, right? We haven't uh, been together in quite a few weeks now because I've been traveling and uh, just a lot of stuff going on. Obviously May is here, may Sember, as we call it, events going on all the time, but I'm back. I'm back and it is a beautiful day here in South Florida and it's one of those days where I just have to get outside. It's a Saturday here, just filming around lunchtime and I'll be putting this right out, but um, I gotta go work on my tan. I, I just gotta get outside. And, and when you're doing that, of course you need some energy. And what better energy, especially if you're trying to do some keto dieting, than beef jerky. Beef jerky, that's right. You know, it, it occurred to me yesterday as I was wandering around the store that uh, there's a lot of beef jerky out there. And um, at my local Publix here, I tried to get as much as I could to sample and um, quite honestly it was uh, there was a lot there was a lot of brands and I think I found five and I'm probably missing one that should be in here but um, we're gonna go ahead anyway so we have as you know probably everyone knows the old Jack Links right Jack Links that's probably the most popular one by the way all these are kind of like the original uh, flavor so it's just like whatever I didn't try to go for the teriyaki versions or the ones uh, that have all kinds of flavors because you know what they also have um, they also have uh, usually sugar in them, and that ruins your old keto diet. So we got the Jack Links. You, you'll see all the brands I put up a picture, but we also have, uh, you got this Bridgeford, which looks really good. Um, it has Sweet Baby Ray's gourmet sauce, something like that on it. But anyway, uh, you got that. You got Archer. I, I, hadn't, I haven't had most of these, I have to be honest, but uh, they look pretty good. You got uh, Old Trapper. Old Trapper. So that I've heard before, so that's a good one. We'll do that. And we've got the uh, store brand, Publix Original uh, store brand. So we'll try that. I've had this before. I've had the Jack Lang's hat. I don't think I've had any of the other ones. The only one I couldn't find, which I didn't see at least in the original version, was Oberto. And I see that everywhere when I'm traveling around, certainly in the airports, that, that's there. So, so this is a good traveling food, you know, keep with you. But golly, is it expensive. It's kind of like gasoline these days, you know? It's like, I, I think there was one of the, I can't remember which one, but there was one I think that was about seven bucks. So uh, anyway, we've got all that. Now they're they're in these cups and I don't know which one's which, so I don't have to blind my, blindfold myself. It's already been pre-prepared, as you would say. And hey, we got a palate cleanser this week. And this week I have this uh, Redemption, Redemption Weeded Bourbon. So I do like a good weeded bourbon. I like those Weller products. I have a bunch on the shelf behind me. And, uh, you know, Larceny's, your Maker's Mark, a lot of weeded bourbons, but um, I've been dying to try this one. I've had it for a little while. I think my uh, washing machine's uh, alerting me to something. Hopefully it's not flooding the whole place. But if it does, then I'll get a new floor, uh, I think. So anyway, we've got this Redemption Weeded Bourbon, which uh, will cleanse the palate today. You know, I just, oh, I'm looking forward to this. This is kind of partially lunch, you know? Get out there and suntan, because you need your energy to do that, to lay around in the sun. It's so nice outside. Let's try the old Redemption. That is really good. Really, really good. I think that washing machine is trying to tell me something. Wow, this is so good. Goodness gracious, I like it. Okay, let's get into some beef jerky here. Um, I'm sorry for you vegans or vegetarians or whatever out there. This might not um, have anything to do with you, but if you're gonna be keto, this is a good way to do it. I uh, just got to watch the sugars in these things. And I didn't really look to see how these things stacked in carbohydrates, but it um, looks like five grams. Most of them have. I'm kind of curious on that saucy one. Um, yeah, about the same. About the same. I don't know how many servings. Let's see, serving size, one ounce. About three servings in these things. Come on. I could eat all these bags for a serving, right? Anyway, let's give this a try. I don't know which this one is. It might be a little tough. This one has some good flavor. Mm. So I think my washing machine's possessed. All right, nothing spectacular about that, but I would eat it all day long without any problem. Nothing stands out. Good texture. Not too tough. Not too tender. That even makes sense, but I like it. That's a good one. Cleanse the old palate with this wonderful redemption. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I hear your washing machine. Okay, next one up. 
I'm trying to get pieces that are similar size too, so I can compare it honestly. All right, I'm just back. A little more flavor. A little peppery. It's really good. A tad bit tougher than the other one, but nothing too nothing too bad. It's got a peppery, that almost tart type of flavor to it. I like it. All right, it had a little bit of different zing to it, but that's good. Like it? Mm-hmm. You know what's going to be great is flossing after this, too. Because you know how that stuff gets stuck in there, you know? All right, next one up. This one looks interesting. It's kind of falling apart a little bit. Let's, ooh, let's see. Mmm. Okay. Very different. Oh, very good though. Kind of um. Hmm. I get a sense of like smoky barbecueness on this one. That's really good. Mm, that's good. Uh, it's so close anyway. You know, I'm putting these things in order as I'm trying it, but they're all very, very good so far. I have to say, it goes wonderful with the bourbon too. All right, next up, this looks pretty nice. This is the soft actually, let's say. Hmm, a little softer. Hmm. Wow. I'm trying to think what the flavor is. So, there's a sweetness to this one. And, um, I don't know where it's coming from. Is there a sauce or something on them? Hmm. Okay. I'll probably, mm, I'll probably put that one there. It's a weird sort of sauce flavor, and it's good. I'm not saying it's bad, but it's just definitely different there. All right, last one. Mm. I can eat beef jerky all day long and really be happy, you know? This is soft. Okay. This one has some peppery notes to it. Really really hard pepper and not that i don't like that but it's a little a little overpowering to the meat itself now had i wanted peppery i would probably look for it but this is like super like it'll like burning the tongue a little bit all right that only because i think it's not a natural flavor it's like super peppered up and i'm gonna put that last because i don't think it's fair to the other ones because they could have done the same thing it's not bad but it is some strong pepper taste okay let me clean mm, mm, mm. oh i love this stuff all right first in first place for the jerky competition can you believe it jack links jack links good flavor on that one second place old trapper old trapper Third place, which was a good one, I liked it too, is that um, uh, the B, what's that, that one? That's Bridgeford, okay. This had that saucy note to it, I wanna say, I think, right? Fourth place was, um, oh dear, Publix, okay. Good job, Publix, fourth place. It was very good, there was nothing wrong with it. And what was this peppery one? Okay, this was that Archer. Archer. Okay, so Archer had, I will say this, County Archer Provisions was, um, had a lot of pepper to it. And it was good. I'm just going to say it was, it was, um, it was quite peppery. And uh, same amount of carbs. Okay, everything's good with the carbs in about five, six grams per serving. So you want to keep it under 20, I'm sure, if you're going keto. But good for you, Jack Link. The one that's always out there, the one that's so familiar, takes it away. So go get yourself some beef jerky. Get out in the sun today. Enjoy yourselves and get you some of this too. This is really good and not very expensive, I don't think. I can't remember, but it was um, it's pretty good. About ninety, what is it? Uh, Ninety-six proof. Does that say? Okay. 
No, that's 86 proof. 86 proof. Okay. Very good. I like it a lot. Enjoy yourselves today. Uh, good to be back with you. And uh, a lot of things still happening. I can't say if I'm going to be back next week or not. I could be. Um, still get out there tasting those fish tacos, but I'm trying to do it in a, in a way that's going to keep me in the, in the ketogenic lifestyle for a while. See how that goes for me. Hope you're doing great. Pray, praying for you, and i got to go check my washing machine. I'll see you next time.